Hi there. My name is Yukari. And I'm a middle schooler. This may be a little sudden, but I'm just going to say it. I'm going to kill my boyfriend. Why you ask? That's none of your business. And besides, it'd be way too long to tell you anyways. So stranger, will you help me? Really? Well then what are you waiting for? Let's kill him. Oh that looks like Tanaka from the baseball team. What is he doing here so early in the morning? Oh, hey Yukari, what are you doing here so early? I could ask the same for yourself. What you doing here? I thought club practice didn't start until 8am. Thought I'd get in some extra practice before the team arrived. I see. You still haven't told me why you're here at school at 6am Yukari. There must be a reason, right? Hmm. Well, I was trying to pick up something that I left at school yesterday. At 6 in the morning? Yup. Yukari, if you're going to lie, at least make it a believable one. Damn. I should have known he would see through my lie. If I knew this would have happened, I wouldn't have lied in the first place. Well, Tanaka, you caught me. That's not why I showed up so early to school today. I knew it. So what's the reason? You can tell me. I came here early so I could catch my boyfriend by surprise. Your boyfriend? I need to catch him by surprise, to kill him of course. This is a joke, right? Nope. No joke. 100% truth. A lot of things have happened, Tanaka, and my boyfriend did something absolutely unforgivable. So I'm having him pay for it. With his life. You're kidding. Nope. You can't just kill him. What are you talking about? Of course I can. Yukari, that's wrong. Jeez, Tanaka, I thought you would understand. I guess I'll have to kill you too, since you know way too much. I am calling the police. Ahaha. Jeez, Tanaka. I couldn't have you go on and ruin my plan. I still haven't even gotten started. It's too bad. You were here at the wrong place, at the wrong time. Now all I have to do is get rid of the body and clean myself up. Hmm, this is a problem. Where should I go to get rid of the body and clean off all this blood? I got it. I'll just go to the girls' restroom. I'll store Tanaka's body in the old and used stall in the back. There's sinks and everything. I'm sure I can clean all this blood too if I move fast enough. Yay. Everything's gonna work out. There, that should do it. Jeez, Tanaka. You're so heavy. Well, now that I got away, it's time to. Oh my god. You're covered in blood. And did you just stuff a body in the last stall? Miho. You can cut the act. Ha. You got me. I just wanted to act all surprised and junk. Like in those horror movies. You could use a few more acting lessons to be honest. You really think so? I think I'm pretty good. I could probably be an actress. Quit joking around. This is Miho Sonoda. She's a student council president of the school. She looks and acts like a big airhead. But honestly, I think she's just as messed up as me. But this is a pretty tight bind you're in Manamida. Stuffing a body in a stall is a pretty big deal. Not to mention you're covered from head to toe in blood. How about I help you out, Manamida? And how are you going to do that? Well, that's easy. I could provide a fresh, clean new uniform for you. And I could keep quiet about this little body stall stuffing. I could also even help you out to get rid of the body. So what's the catch? You don't beat around the bush, do you? Well, in exchange, I'd like for you to kill a guy for me. Who is it? Just this guy who's been harassing me for weeks. Calls me daily, around 16 times a day. Leaves tons of gifts in my locker. I once even caught him following me home from school. What a creep. I know right? It's getting really out of control. The school won't do anything. And the police won't do anything either. I considered killing him myself but... 
Then you came along. I'm not very confident in my strength. But I know I can help you cover all of this up. If you're willing to work together. How about it partner? Sure thing, partner. Oh goody. I knew you would agree. Let me lend you a spare uniform for now. There. All better right? I suppose so. So who is this person anyways? It's Wakabayashi, from the theater club. That beanpole is stalking you? I'm afraid so. This should be easy. The next body stuffed in that locker will be him. I'll be looking forward to it. Oh, before I forget. She is writing something down on a piece of paper. Here's my phone number. Call me if you need anything, okay? Right. Well, with that settled. I guess I got some work to do. I guess I should start with trying to find that Shu Wakabayashi. Where would he even be though? Duh, the theater room. Now, if I'm correct. Wakabayashi should be somewhere around here. Oh. I think that might be him right there. Why if it isn't Minimida? What is a fine lady like you doing here so early? Well as for me, I was getting ready to prepare for this week's stage performance. No one asked you. I am so very busy, don't even have that much time for beauty sleep. Not that I need it, of course. This week's performance is going to be one of our best, I'm sure. Because I'll be starring as the lead role. Don't talk too much, do you Minamida? I have some business with you Wakabayashi. You don't say. I heard that you've been stalking someone from this school. You've been harassing her day and night. You followed her home one time. Ring any bells? I have not a clue what you're talking about. Look Wakabayashi. I know it's you. Just cough it up. I'm not playing around. Minemida, it, it wasn't me. Hmm. You're a dirty liar Wakabayashi. All boys are. Fine, let's say that I indeed did, stop this person you're talking about. Do you have any tangible proof? The person you're stalking told me themselves that you're the one doing it. That's all the proof I need. That? That's just hearsay. Call it what you want. I know you're responsible, and you're gonna pay for it. Look, I didn't stalk Miho, alright? I never mentioned who it was Wakabayashi. Yukari, please. Don't use my name so casually, you little cockroach. Please. Wait. Ahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahah
Unfortunately, I don't have a spare uniform this time. I do have a sports jersey for the time being though. Here you go. Sai hi hi. Well I guess that's fine. Oh Yukari, don't you know I've got your back? I'll wash out all the blood on the other uniforms so you can wear them soon. Thanks. Thanks for killing Wakabayashi, by the way. Don't worry about it. So what are you going to do now? That's obvious. Kill my boyfriend of course. Just curious. What did he do that was so awful that you decided to kill him? It's going to be a long story. I don't mind long stories. Fine. Whatever you want. It was something that happened a few weeks ago. I wonder where he is. I was hoping we could hang out during lunch so we could eat together. I even work up early to make lunch for him. Oh stop. Ahaha. No, it's true. That sounds like him. You're the most beautiful girl I've ever met. Oh quit it, you're lying. No it's true. You're the most beautiful girl I've ever met. I love you. Minami. What's going on here? What are you even doing here sis? What's the meaning of this? Why Yukari, calm down. Don't tell me what to do. Don't touch him. He's mine. He lied to me. He said he was my boyfriend. He said I was the only one. He lied to you too. No he didn't. You're just jealous of me. I finally have boyfriend that's good to me. And you're trying to take it away from me. Me Nami. He was never your boyfriend Yukari. He was mine. You're just delusional. God, when are you going to be satisfied? Will you be satisfied when you take him away from me? Well you're not going to. Hey. You're my boyfriend right? Of course Minami. See, big sis? He's mine. Now fuck off. No. Yes. So he was dating you and your sister at the same time. And your sister is convinced that you're just making stuff up. And he chose your sister over you. That's disgusting. That's why I have to kill him. Understandable. Good luck then Yukari. Thanks. I've still got plenty of time to catch my boyfriend off guard and kill him. Hmm, the only problem is that he's usually never alone. This is going to be a problem. If he's around too many people I won't be able to finish them all off. If only I could think of some way to isolate him. That's it! I'll wait for him to lower his guard and go into the bathroom. That's where I'll ambush him. I'll just hide in the stall and wait for him to come. Just need him to come closer. Closer. Almost there. Now. I've finally got you. You Yukari. What the hell are you doing? I've finally got you all alone. I'm going to kill you for what you did to me. Put that knife away. Let's talk about this. I've had enough of talking. G-U-H. Tanaka? I thought I killed you. What is he doing here? I thought he was dead. Tanaka's holding a box cutter. Was he planning on surprise attacking me with it? It looks like he stopped in the middle of his attack though. Ugh. His movements have completely stopped. Phew. Looks like I made it in time. Sorry Yukari. Looks like Tanaka wasn't dead. Tried to sneak away and save your boyfriend. I stopped him before he slit your throat though. Thanks. Doesn't look like you're quite done yet though. Your boyfriend is still looking quite well. Haha, <laughs> then don't mind if I do. Finally, it's over. So what now, Yukari? Get rid of the bodies so they'll never be found I guess. I see. Well don't worry too much about that. I can help you. Hey Miho. Yeah. Thanks. For everything. Don't mention it. Thanks for saving me back there, Tanaka could have killed me. Not a problem Yukari. I have one question though. Shoot. Why would you go through all this trouble for me? I mean there was the thing with Wakabayashi, but... You could have easily let me die back there. 
You weren't obligated to do that for me. That's because I like you, Yukari. I care about you. I like you too, Miho. Good to know the feelings mutual. Now let's get down to business. Yeah.